Sunday, I think you were already at the front and you were really happy with the way the sensation were coming back. I guess tomorrow you should be extremely happy because that was quite a ride. <laughs> uh, yeah, it for sure was uh, quite a ride. Um, the mountains we do today, they are uh, one of they are the most beautiful mountains you have on this planet. Um, a lot of people, they uh, they would take holidays to come and do these mountains. And for me, it's it's my job. And I try to enjoy it as much as, much as possible. I try to approach the race a, bit, a little bit as a grand, grand fondo and try to enjoy as much the climbing as I can. Uh, and I got in a very good breakaway from the start. Uh, for sure, with Remy Cavagna, is a lot of fun. Uh, to be in the breakaway because he also likes to push the pedals hard and I had very good legs. For me it was a special day because 10 years ago I think I did my first real training camp in the mountains and it was in this region. Uh, we often did a Croix de Fer uh, with my best friend Jeffke. He was a professional at that time, not a professional anymore. Um, but Jeffke and me we often did a Croix de Fer and now I'm in one of the biggest races of the world. Um, approaching the Croix de Fer as a first rider so it was a special feeling. Yeah, please, we, we, we know you as a, as a time trialist, as a classic specialist, but you have spent some time or so in the, in the high altitude training for the hour recall, so it's really your terrain a bit. Well, I wouldn't say it's my terrain. Um, I used to be a time trial specialist with the hour record as a highlight, of course, um, and recently um, I would say since since the, the COVID times, uh, I started uh, being more all round, focus more on classic races, and I think I also became a better climber. Uh, I uh, I think I can say without a problem that today was my best climbing performance, uh, and it's also quite special for a non-real climber to wear the uh, the climber jersey in the Dauphiné, which is uh, I would say one of the hardest one week stage races there are and you will go tomorrow to, to try to keep it until the end <laughs> it will be very hard to defend uh, the mountain jersey i know there are a lot of mountains tomorrow uh, and i know pierre latour i've had a lot of fun uh, with pierre latour during this dauphine already um, and i know he's eager to take this uh, mountain jersey but uh, i will not give it away for free but i will suffer a lot tomorrow thank you victor thank you very much good to see you there